with all the integrity commissioner's report, yes. um, are you planning on taking up the offer of diversity training? Because he says he can't actually force you to, or even recommend that you do, just recommend that it's out there. Well, council did pass a motion to bring in uh, someone to give us some uh, diversity training. I think we could all use it. Um, I, you know, um, but just um, sometimes we have to be reminded. Uh, like I think most of us are pretty responsible and and recognizing the diversity of our community. Um, and uh, and perhaps it's a good idea to have uh, someone come in just to remind us and discuss uh, issues. How do we deal with? Uh, Angry residents that uh, you know are come to us, and and I, that concerns me. That um, you know, you know what happens in society when people are not happy. Some go, you know, they lose it. They do all sorts of things. You know, we see what's happening now in the states. These are people, disgruntled people. So we, you know, we're getting into a, a society where uh, people uh, are being are disgruntled. They're not happy with government. They think that government is uh, not. Uh, well, you see what the, the voter turnout is at municipal level, and that's because they have, I believe that they're not, uh, you know, they just don't have time for politics anymore. Uh, they see what's happening around the, with, in politics. And so uh, this is an, an issue that uh, I believe um, uh, we as a, as a government, as a municipality, as, as a council, we, we should take that into account. There are angry people out there. They're angry about a lot of things. They're angry about the high taxes. They're angry about traffic congestion. They're stuck in traffic. They you only know, go spend two, three hours uh, to go back, back and forth to work, and, and these are really good, good, this legitimate concerns. And uh, so, how do we deal with these angry people? And actually, uh, when I made my little uh, communication, uh, email communication with uh, the resident, uh, I, I was really trying to uh, kind of. Uh, um, uh, say, hey, guy, look here, uh, lady. You know, you know, we're not. You know, the, um, uh, you know, things are not as bad as you're uh, as you're making it out to be. Basically, uh, so I tried to give a. Uh, you know, I said my I used to, I, my first word was in fairness. I was look, I'm looking for fairness, and I've, that's what I was trying to um, get across to the constituent, fairness. And uh, but anyway, I. I do believe that um, you know, as uh, as human beings, uh, we're not perfect. Uh, sometimes we tend to go off the track a bit, and uh, a reminder once in a while is a good thing. You stand by your apology. It was is simply you, you misspoke. I, I just I just used the, the wrong word. I sh instead of said white values, I should have said Canadian values, and that's where uh, I think it. Uh, I I went I I went wrong in my line of thought um, it, 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 it looking back uh, would I have done this dif differently in, uh, to respond to the resident with a with the way that she was attacking uh, our staff here at the city and some people took offense to it and uh, made it blew it out of proportion otherwise uh, if this uh, this would have stayed between uh, the resident and I. She didn't complain about this. She didn't make a big story or, uh, well, you, you saw the emails, uh, our exchange. She didn't find my comments offensive, even though she considers herself to be an, uh, 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 a person uh, of, um, uh, of color, mm -hmm. okay? And so uh, to me, um, uh, if anybody should have been offended, it should have been the resident. And there was no... There was no uh, indication that she was offended by my uh, my comment at all. So I, I think that it was unfortunate that this uh, got spiraled. Uh, it got became uh, it, it got out as if as, you know this is a, a public statement, which it was not. And if I, I was certainly, if I had known this was going to blow up the way it did, I certainly wouldn't have used the word white. I would have used Canadian values.